Welcome to Tow Industry Week. I'm Emily Oz. Two vintage trucks made waves in the Atlantic City Wrecker pageant at the American Towman Expo. Take a look. Masterfully restored, this 1940 Ford and this 1956 Rio are the vintage showpieces for the fleet of Badalini's Garage in Landisville, New Jersey. Here is the original shop built in 1921 and a century later, Badalini Garage is still in the same location. But now their empire touts both a transport and a wrecker sales division. Still family owned, the original Badalini, Alessio, was an Italian immigrant and a true pioneer who went to Sweeney Automotive School in the year 1918 and built that original garage back in 21. His son, Dominic, took over and now his sons, Albert and Anthony, own the business, along with Anthony's two sons. Four generations of Badalini's at the helm. We spoke with Albert about what it meant for the family to have these hard-working wreckers restored and then on display at the 2019 American Towman Exposition. Those trucks got a lot of attention. It was nice to see, and I was able to take my father down there. He's 92 years old. And it was a kind of a proud moment for me with my father. He was a little overwhelmed because I didn't tell him where I was taking him because he's in, his health is failing. So he doesn't walk very much. He's still got his mind. He's still pretty sharp. But he, I didn't tell him where I was taking him. And then when we walked inside the convention center, he's, you know, he, he got excited because, you know, the towing industry was his life. And uh, then I didn't tell him that I had taken the Rio and the Ford there and I brought him around the corner. And uh, he seen them there, he started to get teary eyed. Both records were restored to perfection in the 1980s by Albert. But here's the story about his father's forward thinking handiwork. First, the 1940 Ford. It's a home built unit. My father built that. It has a manly hand crank unit on it, it has a homemade center boom with an 8,000 pound garwood winch that my father put on that. When my father got out of the service in 1947, he started building the sides and the center boom for that truck and put the garwood winch on that. And now the 1956 Rio. My father bought that as a truck tractor out of Philadelphia and he built the back end on that in 1960. The Rio is pretty unique because it has an extendable boom and it has a power boom up and down. And at that time, you know, the big manufacturers weren't offering that homes and, and well-built. You know, they weren't offering those kind of things at that time. I think he was pretty much ahead of his time with, you know, building the extendable boom. I'm pretty proud of what he did and, and I wish I had his engineering skills. And the Wreckers both took honors in the world's largest Wrecker pageant in 2019 in Atlantic City. The Ford, first place in vintage, and the Rio, second place in medium duty. And if nothing else, it was worth it just to see my father's face when I took him there. I can't describe it. I tell everybody I'm proud of our history and I'm really excited about our future. Thanks, Al. And thank you for watching American Towman TV.